National Weather Service has issued a severe weather statement for the following cities. Chicago, Naperville, Aurora, Elgin, and Schoenberg. Beginning at 12 p.m. until 12.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time. It is unknown if this event will continue. However, winds are soaring at a speed of 60 km per hour, and it is possible that a tornado will occur. Due to these winds, temperatures around the mentioned cities are dropped down by minus 4 degrees Fahrenheit. A severe weather statement or special weather statement means that a form of weather advisory. Special weather statements are issued by the National Weather Service of the United States, the NWS, and the Meteorological Service of Canada, the MSC. Make sure to be vigilant at all times. If you want to go outside, make sure to wear clothing that protects you from cooling down your body. The National Weather Service has issued a severe weather statement for the following cities. Chicago, Naperville, Aurora, Elgin, and Schoenberg. Beginning at 12 p.m. until 12.30 p.m. The National Weather Service has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for the following cities. Chicago, Naperville, Aurora, Elgin, and Schoenberg. Beginning at 12.45 p.m. to 13 p.m. Central Daylight Time. The National Weather Service has detected a thunderstorm with a heavy precipitation of 45 km per hour with winds gusting as fast as 70 km per hour that it is possible that this thunderstorm can also be capable of producing a tornado. With winds soaring down at this speed, some small trees have been uprooted, some roofs have been teared off, and temperatures in some cities drop down to minus 10 degrees Fahrenheit. All residents, make sure to be vigilant at all times, wear a raincoat if you want to go outside. The National Weather Service has issued a severe thunderstorm warning for the following cities. Chicago, Naperville, Aurora, Elgin, and Schoenberg beginning at 12.45 p.m. to 13 p.m. Central Daylight Time. The National Weather Service has detected it. The National Weather Service has issued a tornado watch for the following cities, Chicago, Naperville, and Aurora. With some surrounding cities, Elgin and Schoenberg, beginning at 13.30 p.m. to 14.30 p.m. Central Daylight Time. The National Weather Service has confirmed that the thunderstorm can produce a tornado, which however, can be an EF3 tornado. All residents in the mentioned cities, it is recommended for you to evacuate. When evacuating, gather enough supplies such as food, water, clothing, and medical supplies. Don't forget a battery-powered radio with extra batteries to tune into local media outlets for some more information. A tornado watch, same code, TOA, is an alert issued by national weather forecasting agencies when weather conditions are favorable for the development of severe thunderstorms that are capable of producing tornadoes. The National Weather Service has issued a tornado watch for the following cities. Chicago, Naperville, and Aurora. With some surrounding cities, Elgin and Schoenberg. The following message is transmitted at the request of the Chicago Emergency Management Agency. A shelter-in-place warning has been issued for the city of Chicago. All residents, either you have two choices. 1. Seek underground shelter immediately, or 2. Evacuate from the city.
Also, don't forget to gather enough supplies that can last long for you, such as food, water, clothing, medical supplies, and a battery-powered radio. Tune into local media outlets for more information. Please stay tuned for more further updates on this dangerous situation. The following message is transmitted at the request of the Chicago Emergency Management Agency. A shelter-in-place warning has been issued for this.
National Weather Service and the Aurora Emergency Management Agency. The National Weather Service has confirmed that the tornado will be an EF2. The other EF2 is located at Naperville, but one is an EF3, much dangerous, and is located at the city of Chicago. Effects on the CF2 tornado will reach a speed of 160 to 135 miles per hour, and when this happens, roofs will be torn off, frames off houses and foundations have been shipped. David Koch true snapped, cars lifted off from ground, and it will leave a considerable damage. All residents, if you haven't go to the shelter, seek fallout shelter immediately. Not doing so will face certain death. When you do this, you should gather enough supplies that can last long for you, such as food, water, clothing, medical supplies, and a battery-powered radio. The radio will be the most important thing, as this will have more important information. Tune into local media outlets for more information. Please stay tuned for more information on this dangerous situation. Seek fallout shelter now, I repeat, seek fallout shelter. Now. An administrative message has been issued for the city of Chicago, with some other cities, Naperville, and Aurora. This is an all-clear message, repeating, this, is an all-clear message. The tornadoes have been dissipated. All residents can be safely exit their underground shelters. However, because of these tornadoes, responsible for the destruction, there were massive damage throughout the city, and it will take years to build. Repeating to all residents, all residents can be freely exit their shelters. An administrative message has been issued for the city of Chicago, with some other cities, Naperville, and Aurora. This is an all-clear message, repeating, this is an all-